Hi there. Welcome to Apple World Dislike one time I attempted to break through to BAM, and I resembled I just composed into the hunt bar of TMZ. I very much prefer to sort of go through only the feet of his craft, and it resembled so intensely that it seems like BAM Marguera can't keep a hold of himself and has arrived in hot waters again, this time his kindred ass group part. Stevo has a couple of words to say regarding BAM. You're biting the dust, sibling, and it stinks that I can do nothing to save you from his new breakdown on Instagram, where he's taking steps to smoke rocks until he passes on, which has befuddled the fans accused of substance abuse, further murder, liquor misuse spam. Marjorie is the ideal instance of everything turning out badly for an individual with his new caper as an endeavor to take care of his child. Even individuals near him are showing their anxiety in regards to the big name. So why has Bam spiraled again? Has it occurred previously? And what does Stevo need to say about the entire circumstance? Bam Margera can cause harm control, from scornful remarks to causing a situation with his significant other out in the open to being dependent on liquor. There are positively a ton of terrible things that this person has kept an eye on in his plan for the day. His new Instagram Live has demonstrated that Bam has still far to go for recuperation. Bam Margera, whose long combat medication and liquor fixation facilitated a video for his web-based entertainment, is taking steps to legally raise his medication utilization, except if he can see his child. Phoenix says that he's not seen the five-year-old since spring in an erased video. I haven't seen Phoenix in two months. I need to awaken consistently, realizing that I likely will not get to converse with him or, on the other hand, see him. I haven't seen the Phoenix in two months, and I'm so tired. I cry consistently. I miss him so much, and I realize that I need to awaken consistently, realizing that I presumably will not get to converse with him or see him, so yes. Nikki Boyd's legal advisor, David Glass, answered Marjorie's comments in a proclamation imparted to TMZ. Glass said tragically, that is not the way in which addictions work. Individuals' way of behaving doesn't drive others to drink. He proceeded with this as a regular guard system and it shows that Bam might not have learned a lot from his past addictions treatment. You need to truly get a sense of ownership with your own decisions. Nikki trusts that Bam can initially accomplish and afterward keep up with balance to his benefit and bring about some benefit for their child. Nikki petitioned for kid guardianship of their child Phoenix Wolf in September 2021. Anyway, she didn't document a separation request and their eight-year marriage on February 15, 2023, she petitioned for lawful division and spousal help referring to eight. Reconcilable contrasts several has been living independently starting around 2021 authoritative reports express that Nikki is looking for physical and lawful care and the Margera can have parental appearance as long as he and his child stay inside L. Los Angeles province it further subtleties that her thinking for petitioning for division depended on Margera acting improperly while investing energy with their child persuading kid to think Margera was impaired and while discussing him impaired companions and fans are mindful of the peculiar drinking propensities for Bam Margera. It's nothing unexpected that the previous ass star has made his liquor dependence clear to the public. He gave off an impression of being impaired on the show on different occasions and the condition just deteriorated he entered recovery interestingly after a mediation from his loved ones yet did unfinish the program leaving after just four days following dear companion ryan dunn's passing in 2011 marjorie as drinking escalated further and by bog arizona consider he thinks about 2012 the year he failed to keep a grip on his drinking both because of dunn's demise yet additionally in light of the fact that bone spikes constrained him to require a skating profess I am to be postponed and he started hitting the bottle hard to kill the weariness he was in and out of recovery for a really long time following his most memorable visit and in 2016, he conversed with individuals about relearning his skating stunts following quite a while of manhandling. Liquor, I required a five-year break from skating since I had bone prods, so all things considered I was bringing in cash by doing club appearances, which fundamentally was shooting photographs and making efforts with local people, he said, so I was a pack squandered consistently and in the end was like this needs to stop once I awakened in my own vomit and piss, I realized I needed to remove it. He additionally got serious about his emotional wellness issues incorporating his battles with uneasiness and dietary. Problems quite a while back Instagram saw another psychological episode that Bam had and obviously was impaired, who the considerations on the off chance that I'm plastered as damnation or not any longer after. 
S has placed me through some serious hardship and damnation on in wheels for 18 months, keeping me in Pennsylvania. I was unable to leave in the event that I left, or in all likelihood, I'd taken the restraint. Connection at 3 o'clock consistently, 6 o'clock, and 8 o'clock Marjorie's habit and emotional well-being inconveniences caused a crack among him and his family. His profession, furthermore, impacted his contribution to the establishment. Margie has been training in Knoxville and Tremaine as of late for not permitting him to be an AS4. Following quite a while of public inebriation and explosions that brought up fundamental doubt on the off chance that he was fit to star in the film, Margie is being cut from the film, which has made things much more muddled among him and the ass family. Steve-O was one of the ass stars who likewise managed his own fixation battles. The stand-in got it together over 10 years prior and turned his life around when TMZ got some information about Margera's backslide. Steve-O didn't sound confident about his long-term companion, which I saw in TMZ discussing him drinking again. It's miserable, fella. I sort of saw the signs. It was anything but unexpected. The main thing that would shock me is that he possibly drinks. It's miserable in light of the fact that when Bam was in recovery, I had the option to have a genuine talk with him. He said it becomes forever and a day getting past you, and at one point in the event that you have a liquor addiction, I don't think anybody appears in recovery accidentally. Assuming you have experienced liquor abuse, you must do what sober individuals do. It's as simple as that. Inquiring as to whether he accepted his co-star was level-headed for quite some time, he said, I don't want to get down on him or attempt to talk about him, yet seeing what he's posting, you can sort of see where he's at. I've heard individuals say graciously that he's drinking, which is miserable, and that is what will occur again and again until you do what works. There's stuff we do that works. I love Bam, and I believe he should have a decent life. What's more, be solid. That is all anyone needs. Steve-O celebrated 13 years of temperance in the spring and denoted the event by showing how far he's come and giving a holler to Knoxville. It was so appreciative to celebrate 13 years of collectedness today because of every individual who assisted me with arriving. Stevo begged Bam Margera to pick recuperation in the remarks of an Instagram post telling his long-term ass colleague you're kicking the bucket sibling. Stevo had welcomed Margera to go with him on a visit, calling Margera the Britney Lances of ass, and honestly letting crowds know that he trusted the shows would assist Margera with getting it together per TMZ. Margera completed a one-year substance misuse program in 2022, however, a short time later, she had supposedly battled to remain sober, as indicated by Stevo. Those battles proceeded and have since been erased. On February 1, Stevo composed, Bam. The previous evening, you had your five-year-old child with you in front of an audience at my show, and you were honored with an opportunity to go through one more little while with him. Then, when you left my show, you remained up the entire evening, getting stacked. Stevo proceeded with you saying you need to have a relationship with your child. However, your activities ensure the specific inverse will happen. I got you on a visit with me, trusting that I could inspire you to see what's workable for you, assuming you pick recuperation. I've had a go at all that I would be able to do, yet I can't drive you to get genuine and accomplished crafted by recuperation. I want to realize the amount I've loathed feeling prepared for fresh insight about your passing, but you're clarifying that I have no other decision. He proceeded with your kicking the bucket sibling, and it stinks that I can do nothing to save you on different events. Stevo has expressed his sentiments with respect to the entire circumstance and showed worry about his companion. His remarks frequently incorporated a cruel, rude awakening for Bam, yet tragically, the endeavors appeared to have come to no end considering the new breakdown he had on his Instagram. Live liquor enslavement is dangerous, as we can see from the circumstances that it's driven. Bam Margera.